Today we're gonna practice drawing like an Egyptian. I have this sheet that has some different um, Egyptian odds and whatnot on here. And I want you to pick one that you want to represent you. We're not gonna copy it completely. You're just going to um, have one as a base to change. So, you know, you could pick one that's more like an animal or you could pick one that's more like a person with a headpiece. On the trace it side, you can put your paper on top and it's a little tricky to see, but you should be able to see it. I really want you to just trace the outside part so you can get the general shape. Although we are going to draw it on our own for the final, sometimes tracing can help us kind of get the shape of it before we try to draw it on our own. You can do things to make it your own. You can, um, a lot of times the Egyptians have these like necklace pieces, but you can do whatever design you want on the inside of it. You can make yours look like they're wearing an Egyptian outfit, or you can make it look like you're wearing an outfit that you would wear. I'm gonna give myself a skirt here. Once you've done that, then I want you to give an attempt to drawing it yourself. You don't have to make it exactly the same. You can make some changes. Um, I'm gonna start with the hat because I think that's gonna be easiest. Okay, so I'm looking at kind of this oval shape. I see it goes in and back out. I see that there's these little pieces. Our papyrus paper that we made um, is pretty thick, and so it's not easy to see through in order to trace. And so um, we're gonna have to draw it on our own. Um, I see a profile here where a nose sticks out. So I'm gonna make sure I have a nose that sticks out. I might do some small little, almost like fish lips since it's the side of the face. I see the shoulders are straight on. Okay, the feet always go to the side for the Egyptians, so make sure yours are doing that. Okay, I can practice as many times as I want on this piece. Once you're feeling comfortable, then we can take this and draw it on our paper. You can do it any direction. Um, we are gonna add more things to this to make it tell a story, um, but for now, we're just gonna draw our person. One side I've written your name, the other side is the one we're gonna use to draw. When you're happy with it and checked it with me, then you can Sharpie it. Because of how detailed it is, I'm actually gonna use a pen Sharpie. 